Hey guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting to ranked two episodes 9 and 10 of Simpuggy G. Okay, so we all know how last week ended, and of course, I mean, by the time, really, thank you, car. Oh my god, I can't wait to get out of there. Like, oh my god, it's gonna be so awesome. As I was saying, um, we all know how last week's episode ended, and literally, just, I don't want to see that again, but I have a feeling they're gonna show just the building exploding. He would keep freaking out over Miku and then me just like, uh, I don't want to see it. But yeah, other than that, let's go ahead and get started with episode nine and three, two, one, go. I fucking told you. <laughs> I don't want to see this again. But we know Miku's gonna be okay. I mean, oh my god, but still, seeing this, like, my heart, I can't. Fucking girlfriend. <laughs> I don't want to see him. Y'all didn't really have to show that to me again. I mean, we could have skipped that. We could have just started the episode. <laughs> no, we got to show, like, the last few bits of last week, which to me felt like... No, because I did record that last week, yeah. It just feels like <laughs> several freaking weeks. But yeah, I mean, I'm not ready for this. I hope... No, I don't think they're going to show it in this episode. They might actually announce it with What's Her Face being, you know, the true contender to being, uh, to having Fina Soul inside of her. But I felt like they're going to wait until 11, 12, and 13 to possibly say that. I'm not 100% sure. But, I mean, maybe maybe not it just really depends i i don't think anything shocking well no let me take that back something shocking is gonna happen in nine and ten of course it's gonna be something don't know what don't know how i don't know also i still feel bad for maria because you know maria was can we not i mean maria was like thinking oh my god yeah mm -hmm. fina is gonna you know her soul's gonna be in my body and, and shit like that. And then next thing you know, mom's like, no, you are not the contender for Fine. You're, you're just let go. And you're just like, okay, well then who is? And then you show me that ish. And I'm just like, it's her, ain't it? Like, come on. It, it, it's obvious, but I'm just waiting for the show to just do it and just say it.
Flash and Miku would not come up until like the last three episodes of this show. I just have that feeling because why would you show an explosion in the well last week's episode, showing it again in this episode, and then it just seems like she's MIA, dead, whatever. And the next, you know, she's just gonna show up, <laughs> and she is going to be so fucking pissed. It's like season one all over again. The, the who phoenix? That's a good question. Oh my god! <laughs> I think that is something I would say. <laughs> I'm gonna get that mushroom off your face. <laughs>
But that's wrong. Can we not? No. This is a bad idea. We don't trust him. I don't like him. Seriously? Yeah, by the doctor. Chris is me in the mornings. Mm -mm. <laughs> like, yes, let's go on a run. Me, no. <laughs> I want to go back to sleep. Workout. It lasts two weeks. <laughs> Mm, so you grabbed her. Because she looks like your sister. Mm -hmm. I get that. Yeah, but you know, Maria, you could have dropped her off somewhere. I mean, because you look like her sister. All they're really going to do is just, like, because they have Miku right now, they're just going to use Miku to just bring Hibiki and then shit like that. I mean, come on now. Why are the reasons why they would take Miku? It's obvious. Mm. No! Nah! <laughs>
Yeah, I know. I, don't like, I didn't like that either. See, I just want Kia to just tell Sheena Bay the truth about what's happening to her. If that is your friend, Kitty, you need to tell her everything. Yes, yeah, she may not judge. No, she might judge you in the beginning, but she'll still protect you. Hell, she's probably going to be dying by the end of the series. Really, the same. This is just a bad idea right now all over it. It's just, I want her to stop, like, dead ass, but there's nothing else she can really do, right? No! I'm so fucking hard at it, TV. But you know, she gonna be hard headed as fuck and she's gonna go out there. I mean, come on. It's TV for Christ's sake. In her heart, no. In her mind, yes. Which is what, Dr. C? Mm -mm, that shit. Him just talking to her just sends a shiver down, a shiver down my mother effing spine. I don't like him. I want him to go. None of this would be happening if Shiva would have done that, went down there. But no, it's happening, and I'm scared. Oh! What the hell did you just do? Why? Kitty!
You, okay, I thought they were gonna end it. God damn it, Kitty. Oh my god, no. Was it Serena? Nico! I have nothing to say about that. I was not expecting that at all. I thought it was going to be <laughs> Sheena Bay. They have possessed me because they were so far. I didn't think that they would have used Miku. Are you serious? What the fuck? She's going to have to fight her girlfriend. I don't want them. I don't want the girlfriends to fight. This is wrong. No! No! No, I don't like this. Not one mother effing bit. No. If you would have told me at the end of season one that this ish would have happened at, like so close to the end of season two, I probably would have looked at you like you was fucking crazy. This. Mm -mm. Mm-mm. <laughs> no, mm -mm. I can't. No, what the fuck just happened? Oh, my God. No. Oh, fuck. Thundercats. Oh, my God. No. My child is freaking possessed. She ha She's technically using a gear, but she's possessed. And mm -mm. No. 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 No, no, this is worse than the big spoiler of Persona 5 R, the ish that you have to do in that, and I can't talk about that until the damn game comes out in the next few months, but still, this is what the fuck just happened, no, because I was just sitting here, I was like, no, I don't think they're gonna use Miku, but every single time, like, that smile that he gave to her, I didn't trust that smile, I was like, nah, he might not do nothing to her, that, oh my god, he, he's not gonna have to use her gear, even if it ends up killing her, I don't want this, you give me the, like, the beginning of this episode where she's just sitting there in the car with a freaking cup of coffee or freaking tea or cocoa, which is, like, the warmest thing I have is gone. And then she's like, we use okay, and then you give me this, this, like, <laughs> I don't want either Shibasa or Chris to fight her because, I mean... They're essentially friends with her. So I, it's not like, you know, a girlfriend type thing. What he, he, they might, even if she's the, like, even if it's like the friendship thing, there are some type of people when, okay, I got to use like things like, okay, let's say, okay, let's say this. 
I'm gonna use like, examples from two different animes, from Fire Force and both freaking Demon Slayer. Let's say your friend, your family member, turns into a demon or combusts into flames like an inferno in either Fire Force or Demon Slayer. You have one of two options. Either you run the fuck away or you possibly kill them. The shit that Tenzo had to deal with Nezuko in episode one, this is what this is. In a nutshell, except it's Hibiki going against her girlfriend, and I don't want this. I really just, I'm like, because in a weird way, I kind of want this, but then at the same time, I'm like, no, I really don't want this because I don't want her fighting her best friend who she's secretly in love with. I mean, it's so obvious, but still, this is gonna hurt. This is going to fucking hurt, and I don't think Hibiki is going to do anything until about almost the end of episode, uh, I'm about to say 11, 10, going on into the last three episodes of this season, I, I don't know, I mean, god damn it, doctor, what the fuck, oh my god, why, why, oh my god, like, doing the, the shit, like, talking to Katie, mm -hmm. I really hate the doctor, I, like, essentially hate him more than I did with Fine. I mean, I get the, you know, why Fine had to do what she did, and I was like, okay, yeah, I get that, that's a bad bitch, we still stand her no matter what, I still like her, but this doctor is the most, like, asshole care, like, the biggest asshole of all these characters, really villain-wise in this series, unless there's somebody else to see, watch, there's gonna be someone even worse in season three, season four, season five, five seasons, I believe, in the show. I don't know. My god, I just really don't like the doctor, and I want him to fucking go. Like, oh my god. I just hate that it's worse because of the fact is Maria sides with him, and that pisses me off because I'm like, damn. You could have did so much better. I get the fact that, yeah, you're still pissed that you're not the one who's gonna be the host for Fine. <laughs> Kitty is. But you don't know that. You, you, Sheena Bay doesn't know that. And Sheena Bay just got freaking mauled by her best friend. Like, what the fuck? I'm just like, no. Why? Just why? Out of all the freaking characters, Miku. Out of all the freaking characters, part two. Sheena Bay. For, like, the doctor to really just fuck up and twist these girls' minds. It, it's just, what the fuck? Oh my god. I can't. I fucking can't. What is this show anymore? I don't know. Bru I mean, it is, it's gonna get worse, ain't it? I mean, you know, yes. Like I said, Hibiki is gonna have to go out there. And you know the commander's gonna be like, no, if you go out there, you're gonna die if you use it again. And she's gonna be like, I don't care. It's my girlfriend. I love my girlfriend so freaking much. I want to save my girlfriend. Shit like that. And she's just Oh my god, I don't, I don't want this, like, Jesus, I don't even want to watch the next episode, because I'm scared. So, Boss and Chris are going to not fucking hesitate, they're probably going to try to kill Miku. <laughs> oh my god, no. Why is this happening? Oh my god, no. This hurts so freaking much. Oh my god. I need a moment. <laughs> like, dead ass before I watch this next episode. Like, oh god. Oh, uh, I can't. I mean, I need a drink. I, I don't want this. I need alcohol. Because, shit, I mean, episode 7 and 8, I mean, the shit that happened in that, like, blew me to bits. But this episode, I mean, I, it's, <laughs> Mm -mm. Go ahead and pause the video and I'll see you guys in one second for episode 10. <laughs> okay, episode 10 in 3, 2, 1, go. <laughs> I don't even want to see that.
Any other surprises you want me in this episode? In the last three episodes of this, even though we're not there, we'll be there probably maybe this weekend, maybe on Sunday. I don't know. Is there anything I need to know about? Because <laughs> I want to know now. Because I don't think this show could surprise me anymore. It probably can. <laughs> but, <laughs> like, no, I, mean, I don't think nothing will trump anything that happens after this season except that moment right there. Just seeing her being controlled and possessed. It's gonna, you know, okay. You know what? Let me say this. I, you know, if one of the seasons opens up with a fan favor getting killed, I, I think that will probably trump that. Maybe. Or something. I don't know. It's going to be something. Something is going to trump the shit out of this moment. And I'm just going to be like, remember what I said in episode 10 of G of season two, thinking nothing else is going to trump the scene. And then this scene comes along and I'm just like, fuck. I just can't believe this is happening. I, I get the fact that, yes, out of all the characters, Miku, but goddamn man, like, ugh. Hey, Vicky, what the fuck are you gonna... Like, honestly, what could you do in that situation? Mm. <laughs> hey, Mom. Who else does this shit? <laughs> Maria, if you would have just left her there, took her and dropped her off somewhere, none of this. Because of the fact is Miku was crying in the la in last week's episode about the fact that she really just wants to help Yuki. I get that. But this ain't the way. Because of the fact that she loves the shit out of Yuki. That too. <laughs> and see if freaking Kitty didn't give she to me the anti leaker, she would be able to help right now. But no, things happen for a freaking reason. Does that look fine to you? That don't look fine. This girl about to kill y'all. Not even phasing her. Oh, okay, never mind.
Jesse Maria, you still want this? You could stop this. You could go out there. I wouldn't touch her. Seriously. Yep, she about to kill y'all. I don't want this, but seriously. <laughs> oh my god, Miku, no with this song. Stop! Me. Yeah, you was you didn't tell her your secret. This is for you. You. God, you were such an ass.
Miku. I mean, but shit, people dying like that. I mean, is there really anyone to save now? Man, you really need to pay attention to the center back. So then how the hell are you supposed to stop her then? Don't be stupid. You're not going out there. Just remember, this is the voice actress who's going to be the next pretty cure guy. It's like, oh my god, she's going to be saying shit like this next in a couple of weeks. Oh, I thought he wasn't going to do shit. There is no way in hell she's just gonna see. Oh my God. Then it's a possibility you won't be there. You talking like what's a oh my god She's literally talking like what's her face's mom from flip flappers and I don't like this. Like, oh my god. 
But she has to do it. It's the only way she's gonna bring me cool. But look at her. My heart hurts, but you know, that's not me cool anymore. So, I mean, you're gonna have to do that. <laughs> Uh. Jesus Christ. Should have fucking hope so, but I'm guessing not. Hmm. I think it's so good. I think you ended on a fucking cliffhanger. I don't want to wait until this weekend to watch the next freaking episode. I don't even know if I'm going to have free time on Sunday to watch it. I didn't watch this.
He's fucking dead. Oh my god. As much in my heart, I didn't want to see Miku and Kiki fight. I felt like it was good. It just, it gave me feels to like so many other shows that I've seen. Where, yes, you have to fight your best friend. It's okay. <laughs> Even you're emotional as fuck or you're just like tense in your heart. It's just like, Ugh. oh my god. Just let them both be okay, please. Because, I mean, you just showing that. Whatever's gonna pop up next week or in a couple of days when I have the time to watch it. Oh god, I don't like this. I'm not ready for this. I'm scared. I am fucking scared. Oh my god. Can we just say like oh okay, never mind. So just an island with pillars around it and a bit oh I got a mess to clean up. What the fuck? What? No! What the Chris? What the fuck? No! Mm mm. Mm mm. Nope. Mm mm. Mm 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 mm. Mm mm. Mm mm. Mm mm. Mm mm. Uh uh. Nope. Nope. <laughs> No, 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 mm -mm. no, 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 no to the infinity and beyond. No, are you freaking kidding me? What, girl? Please tell me. Please say psych. Like, no, that did not just fucking happen. Like, Dead ass. You have got to be freaking kidding me. That did not just happen. This, no. She's, you gonna fucking tell me the whole entire time Chris has been flip-flopping back and forth when Chris has been good? No, we're, we're, I'm still looking at, you know, her episode where she's saying, best girl right there, and then you give me this. Unless, no, okay, hold up. Unless secretly. Maybe. Tsubasa and Chris had a conversation like, hey, I want you to shoot me and look like you betrayed us, but not really. Like, you serious? I can't wait till next week to watch the next <laughs> Fuck that. No, I'm watching this tomorrow. I can't wait. No. Uh-uh. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm. No. <laughs> No, I'm literally going to have to watch the next two episodes tomorrow after Asteroid in Love and <laughs> done recording freaking Horizon in the Middle of Nowhere next episodes for the following week. Because there is no way in hell. I, I can't wait until next week. You can't give me an ending like that and expect me to freaking... I can't even imagine how y'all was when this came out and any of y'all sitting there watching it and... I can't even imagine that the fact is that this shit was posted on freaking YouTube for Crunchyroll's channel and so many people are watching this every single week and they got to this part and they're all probably sitting here like, what the fuck? Because 
they're now on Simple Gear GX. And so, yeah, I'm behind and shit like that because, you know, for reasons. But. I can't. No. Oh, my God. No. What, are you serious? What well, out of all the people? I, I understand. But why Chris? Like. See, no, this is like some bullshit. This is the type of shit that, I mean, it, it could just be the, the crap, like the shit that, you know, Fine still has hold over Chris. Like how I can go back to compare to freaking Overhaul and freaking Eddie John from My Hero or literally Lisa and Giovanni from Fire Force. You have got to be kidding me. You are basically, like, are you freaking telling me, like, Fine's mind or somewhat, her conscience or whatever, she's talking to Chris, and she's like, oh, hey, go kill Subasa and stuff. And then you just end with that, and you expect me not to be <laughs> shocked, pissed off, anything. It's 11.44 at night. It's about to be midnight in the next few minutes. Like, God damn it, no. Oh, my God, No. Mm-mm. No, I, I can't. I, I, you know what? Mm-mm. I, <laughs> episodes 7 to 10. I cannot accept in my heart. Love them all. Good ass episodes, but the, I mean, the endings, I have to say for this season, are like freaking top tier. And they, each and every episode has left me like, dead lying on the floor like bitch like that really happened but oh my god this this just it, it just trumped the Miku thing right then and there because oh my god I wasn't expecting anything big to happen but Chris is like no we got one little more last surprise before this episode ends I got three episodes left plus this freaking OVA and you oh my god Yeah, mm hmm. I, I just can't, you know. Other than that, guys, that was my reaction to three episodes 9 and 10 of Sipoki G. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like, it really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Magical Squad, and of course, I will see you guys mm -hmm, next Friday for the Patreons and next Thursday for everybody else for episodes 11 and 12. Because there is no way in heck you're going to see all three of them damn episodes all at once. Because it's better for me to just have 11 and 12 together and then to do 13 in the OVA. Because, um, what the fuck? So yeah, I'm literally going to just go ahead and watch the next episode tomorrow after the other things that I got to do. Because, mm, I, you know, I got time tomorrow and I really don't want to wait until next week to see what in the world. I mean, shit, is there anything else I need to know? You want to go ahead and tell me anything I need to know? Because, I mean, if anything else surprises the shit out of me, I mean, Jesus, like, I, I mean, go ahead, write a comment, say something, I don't care. I mean, but God, ooh, Chris. <laughs> Chris, <laughs> we gotta have a talk. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.